Wait, no. Hold on. Um, wait, what? I already know the story. Sure. Why not? I already know the story. I already finished it. Hold on. Okay. Music is on. My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker house. Wait, three years? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I was looking for my wife. Who That's actually pretty quick of you getting more shit. Life. She told me to come get her. Wait, where are my subtitles? What the heck? I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Later, I remember I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's where I got welcome to the family, son. Infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms. Oh, we're choosing that that ending. Or we don't save Zoe. <laughs> then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. <laughs> Rib Zoe. <laughs> Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. It's all over now. Ah, uh, sweet, sweet Ethan. It's never over. All right. Yeah. Resident Evil Village. Fun. This is what we're doing tonight. Also lagging like hell here. Because I need to... Borderless. All right, I had to make sure that I'm not lagging anymore. Okay, uh, I'm not. I'm okay, we're good. We're fine. We're fine. Um, standard. That's fine. <laughs> Wait a minute. This isn't the game I ordered. Long ago, <laughs> a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father. Who was hard at work. I think I downloaded the wrong game. Them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Bat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank uh, what the the okay. dark blood and smiled with joy. D who the, the fuck rain drinks rain random rain bat blood? blood. <laughs> the fuck? And the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared. And with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Uh, Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself um, and smiled oh. with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But Lots of questions. tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate. Then you eat a friend. Oh, what? My brain. <laughs> she soon entered the forest dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. <laughs> he said, you fool. And summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beasts. 
Suddenly, a witch appeared. Dark, yet regal. Oh, well, she's dead. <laughs> more of the story, kids. Not everything's yours. <laughs> so more than turning on his TV. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. So can we talk about the fact that you're reading a horror story to your child? What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Right. <laughs> the store said it was traditional. Traditional, my ass. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't. Because she. Oh my Thank God. God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that. Remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. Are you Just sure about that? Annoying. It's not. Never mind. I'm, I'm sorry, but I'm not paranoid. I'm just. She's cautious. gonna choke that child. <laughs> Go cautiously. Take yeah, Ethan. You're all, you are Ethan, right? I'll finish dinner. Put the child on the couch and walk away. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember. I can't blame her. Oh, what? I'm playing now? Did you say something? Nothing. Nope. I'll put her down. Okay, then let's never use those choice of words ever again. <laughs> I wish I could drop her. <laughs> get the bad, get the good ending. <laughs> ah, we're gonna drink wine. Does baby want wine? Yes. <laughs> Okay, how do I know the layout of your house? Just go this way. Wow, dude. Nice, nice crib. NTV. NTV. Hey, keep it down. Just making sure it's locked. What the fuck, dude? Just leave me alone. Actually, I want to explore your house more now. I'm gonna make sure she wakes up. Just carrying her around. Oh. Oh, you have an extra door to your kitchen. Let's go see what mom's making. Better not be no BS. Don't fucking tell me. I want to know what you're cooking. What do you have? <laughs> I'm not eating anything, especially... What are you doing, mister? Nothing. That I, what? Um, I'm out of here. Okay. What's in here? <laughs> that oh. Mia makes everything by hand, so this stuff keeps piling up. No. It is Mia. Okay, so you are Ethan. Tell Mia the whatever she's cooking to stop, please. <laughs> no more. Also, how are you, how is your hand and your legs doing? Did they reattach everything all right? <laughs> Anything in the drawer? Nothing in the drawer. Okay. All right. All right. Shut up. <laughs> there, there. It's like I said to your mom. She put raisins in everything. Oh God. I'm not a huge raisin friend. <laughs> raisin fan. I might, I might have to get rid of Mia. See, this is the reason why we should have saved Zoe. No, we can't. We can't just. Okay. I mean, the toilet seat's open. We can just flip. No. <laughs> well, what's going on down here? Is this my room or your room? I would. This whole corner screams creepy as fuck. Uh, I remember you. Keep this around. I should get rid of it someday. Yeah, giving you bad memories. I don't think I would ever just be sitting over here on this couch looking down this creepy ass hallway where I'll be paranoid to see if somebody just peek around the corner. <laughs> this oh, this is yeah, this is the baby room. This looks like a baby room. Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. 
This is fine. <laughs> Their investigation of the 18th. I increased my DPI on my mouse because it's like really slow. I might have to increase increase it in game. That's really building up. Uh oh, Jad Baker. Oh, okay, so this is going on through like what have went down in the mines, I'm guessing. <laughs> my soul. I pick up. All right, child. Tell me, tell me where your room is. I know it's not the bathroom. Your mom and I love this song so much. Oh my God! It's spelled. Get rid of it. <laughs> Almost there, honey. She's gonna start crying as soon as we get to the fucking room. Where is is it? She. Hmm, an amount of toys. I already feel like I'm going to step on a Lego soon. First off, excuse me. If that is the crib thing making that noise, that is concerning. <laughs> Shut up. Nobody asked you. Ah, well, they're constantly having fights. Ah, that just means they're having a healthy relationship. What do you mean? It's fine. Every couple goes through relationship issues like that. I just don't want to fight Mia, dude. She boxed me up in the <laughs> in the other game. <laughs> what keeps her from changing and boxing me up in this game? Did I just drop the baby to look at this fish? Okay, I was about to say. <laughs> it's not paranoia. They really have to get you. I mean, you're not wrong. Well, hi there, little Rose. <laughs> For some reason, I feel offended. How dare they? <laughs> All right, we're going to put the baby in his bed now. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> All right. Can't keep <laughs> she's scary when she's angry. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Oh, uh, yes, I will. <laughs> They can have you, it's fine. Uh, my controls, can I please increase my sensitivity? Okay, hello, game. Sensitivity, please. Game settings, reticle. Um, wait, do I not have sensitivity? Wait a minute. Controls. Oh, I don't think I do. Oh, no, here it is. Okay, I was about to say, I was going to lose my mind. I say there has to be sensitivity for how slow it is. Or maybe that's just going through this scene. Yeah, I think it's just going through this scene. So I'm going to have to lower that probably later. <laughs> what are you, No, really, what are you cooking? <laughs> Mia, <laughs> please. <laughs> What the heck is that? Is is that a fajita? Is she okay? Sleeping like a well, like a baby. Mmm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, Mister. What the heck? It's chorba de la gum. Ah, you see, <laughs> that just sounds like restroom water. 
Because I'm about to be in there all day. Sulking all evening. Maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Wait, you went through military training after meeting Chris? Wait, why am I allowed to look around? Hold on. Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so... Okay, that was the reason why we were looking around. Mia, get down. Mia's already been... Oh, yeah, I forgot she fell. Well... <laughs> oh. Yep. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> so we forget in the game now. <laughs> Damn, that military training is really coming in handy, dude. Mia. Oh God. I think Mia would be fine. I mean, she survives worse. My table. I paid for it. What the hell? Sorry. I, I'm pretty sure Mia will still be fine. She definitely should have saved Zoe. Damn. <laughs> Damn, Chris. What's going on? What's this beef you got? Dude, Ethan, you had training. You went through worse. Beat his ass. All clear. Rose? What the hell you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Daughter is package. Ethan, no. Yeah. <laughs> For some reason, I saw that coming, but I was also expecting the black screen. I mean, go ahead, take her. <laughs> I've been trying to get rid of it for a couple of minutes now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Doc. Hello, Ethan Winter. I've got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk to my staff. How about the next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the Doc. She'll see us next week. Yeah, Mia has plenty of plot armor for sure. Hey, it's fine. Think positively, all right? It's only a flesh wound. Talked about this. I know. In the fifty cents plot armor. I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. Just Mia, Mia, what are you what talking, are you talking about? about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Mia hiding secrets again. Damn it. I have to take this. Ah, something just tells me it's Mia's fault. <laughs> With that stare, it's my little demon. <laughs> Ethan, answer your phone. You're fine. Jesus. Well, we know Chris is alive. I mean, this is a man who punched boulders for a living. Hmm. Seem like those documents are pretty coincidentally heck? placed. Uh, exterminate, target, recover, body. Secure Rose and Ethan. Okay, so they're trying to exterminate Mia. So Mia is still hiding secrets from us, even now. <laughs> Of course.
Okay. I was trying to make out what the fuck you just typed to me, Shadow, and I was just like, oh, all right, and you explained what he tried to type. <laughs> okay, let's go. Any codes on that? I don't know what that says. Hmm. There seems to be something out in these woods. Be a shame if I just walk right through them, you know. Dude, keep your little feet to yourself. Ah, it seems like there's a trail leading this way. Hmm, I remember this scene. <laughs> Am I playing the Blair Witch? <laughs> They also have a forest. Oh, you're not going to teach me anything. You're just going to tell me to go right through. OK, oh, well, dude, you've been worse. You've lost a hand before. Calm down, even. Dude, stop throwing rocks at me. What the fuck? Oh, these poor crows. Wait a minute. Didn't crows die in the seventh? Hmm. <laughs> they just don't like crows. That's all I'm hearing. Oh, no. You guys will be fine. You're fine. Shut up, crows. You're fine. Hey, nothing worse going to happen to you than what's already happened now. Except for that. That that that's a different sorry. That's a different problem. Where is where is my mallet? Alright, it's dying. Ah oh, yeah, it's fucking Krampus. Dude, what have I done to deserve Krampus of all things? Hello? No jump scare? That would have been a good opportunity for it. Just looking through a random ass window. Ooh, silence. What you got in the drawer? Nothing. <laughs> Just disappointment. I don't think you want to drink that, Ethan. Hmm. That's rather concerning. All right, Ethan, find a gun. <laughs> Put wherever it is out of its misery. Ah, there's a downstairs. Perfect. <laughs> ah, I'm trying to rotate it. Das God! But, or death, whichever one. It's one of the two. Ah, what's in the closet? Tis a rat. But plot twist if you turn around. No? Duh. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> Dude, somebody's fat as fuck. Grab the broom. <laughs> no? <laughs> Okay, we don't believe in grabbing brooms out here, too. Dude, whoever is stepping up there, you're thick as fuck. Calm down. You asshole, why? Imagine if that fell on us. J just lick it. Dude, okay. So we just don't believe in using doors. We just go through walls. It's fine. Krampus. <laughs> Apparently he has his own little 
secret for us or gonna put us in the sack and beat us just w key it's fine Hmm. Everything is fine. Oh. Where the hell am I? Nice castle, bruh. If anything, if there's ever a village with a castle, there's definitely vampires. <laughs> That's just common sense, you know? Only vampires live in castles. Just fun fact for you. <laughs> 